Hi guys! Mabuhay! Kamusta kayo? I'm Red Quaresma from the Philippines and I am a reactor. And if you are new to my channel, don't forget to click the subscribe button together, the tiny bell button down below. And in this video, guys, we're going to be reacting to you this uh, top 3 question answer portion at the Miss Universe 2022. So yeah, I'm really excited, guys, to watch this. So let's play this video and let's um, count in 3, 2, 1, go. So here we go. We'll ask each of you the same exact question. While one finalist answers, the other two will wear sound. Actually, these headphones. three girls each of you will have 30 is deserve for the answer. spot, deserve for the title. No matter what happened, no matter what happened to this competition, I'm still uh, proud to be top three. This is your big moment, ladies. Deep breaths. Because so your this is the moment of truth. Who will become the next? This universe. Let's get to it, Olivia. Olivia Colton. Dominican Republic. So Could you join Dominican us? Dominican Republic. Actually, guys, um, Miss USA is a hot Filipina, hot American. On right now. Thank you. So I'm proud to, I'm proud, I'm really proud to her. All right, here's your question. If you win Miss Universe, how would you work to demonstrate this as an empowering and progressive organization? I understand that the Miss Universe organization is looking for an ambassador, somebody wow. to communicate a message. I have been working for women's rights for as long as I can remember. It's been my actual day every single day. I'm here to demonstrate it doesn't matter where you come from. Your background does not define you. Oh, Your oh nice and answer. You. And I will show that by being working every single day, showing my leadership and determination. Thank you. Wow. Thank you. Very well said. She nailed it. Come on down. Oh my god, Filipino beauty. American. Filipino American beauty. Arvon. Proud favorite. All right. Here is your question. If you win Miss Universe, how would you work to demonstrate this as an empowering and progressive organization? Well, I would use it to be a transformational Ooh. leader. As a very passionate designer, I've been sewing for 13 years. I use fashion as a force for good. In my industry, I'm cutting down oh on pollution God. through recycled materials it. when I make my clothing. I teach sewing classes to women that have survived from human trafficking and domestic violence. Ooh. And I say that because it is so important to invest in others, invest in our community, and use your unique talent to make a difference. We all have something special, and when we plant those seeds to other people in our life, we transform them and we use that as a vehicle for change. Wow. He nailed it. The winning answer. Oh my God. Thank you. The winning answer. What? <laughs> this is the one. <laughs> I'm All so right. proud of you, are winning. Venezuela, come on down, girl. Okay, here's the same question I asked the other two. If you win this universe, how would you work to demonstrate this as an empowering and progressive organization? Si llegaras a ganar Miss Universo, ¿cómo trabajarías para demostrar que esta es una organización que empodera y es progresiva? If I get to win Miss Universe, I will follow the legacy that many women across wow. the universe have showed to be part of this organization. Okay. Because Miss Universe has demonstrated that they choose women who inspire with their messages and transform with their actions. And that's precisely what wow. I would like to do. I'm a fashion designer by profession, but I'm a designer of dreams as a woman. Thank you so much. Uh, okay. Okay. Oh, wow. Actually, I like the answer of uh, Dominican Republic and Mills uh, USA. The answer is came from the heart and I really feel it. And the answer is on point. So yeah, if you like this video, guys, please, please, please give a big thumbs up. And if you have any requests, video comment down below. And see you on my next reaction video. Bye.